Hello, my name is Tug Cowart, along with Caitlin Henderson, and we like to talk about country music. Oftentimes I do it on the show that I uh, host noon to three on Atlanta Sports X with Hudson Mason, but he finds little interest in it, so uh, I have found <laughs> that uh, Caitlin enjoys it a little more. But uh, thankfully, um, DBJ on our show, Brandon, he is uh, a country Woo! music fan Woo! too, and, and he's in this room with us now, and he enjoys country music. So this is a, uh, this is a warm country embrace. We call it uh, Country Quickies. And we're going to run through three of them. One being uh, an artist that you really enjoy. Sure. And she is inducted into the Grand Ole Opry, which is the biggest honor in all of country music. It's even bigger than, than the Country Music Hall of Fame. Definitely, for sure. Yeah. Country Music Hall of Fame is cool, but the Grand Ole Opry, is, that's the gold standard. So, Kelsey Ballerini. Yep, she was inducted. Carrie actually was the one that inducted her. Um, it was really sweet because, like, Ballerini walked out and just started crying. And then Carrie brought her... Um, the little trophy they have and stuff, and I mean, Kelsey started like bowing down to her, and Carrie was like, "Stop, no!" Yeah, but right. It was just really sweet, so um, I enjoyed watching it, and they sang together, and it was really sweet. So. Yeah, I I gotta tell you, I'm not the biggest Kelsey Ballerini fan. Why I'm just is not. That? I don't young? know. I just, no, no, no. I just I don't know why. I just don't relate to her music well. That's all. But I will say the new George Strait song. I don't really like it that well either. Which one is that? Uh, every little honky tonk bar. Okay, I didn't know if it was that dragon, dragon. D R E. That's the one I'm talking about. <laughs> no? no, I didn't make that up. That's a no. real song. I have no that idea. was his like most recent one. I thought. Okay, okay all right. Just kidding. But you know what? Maybe that is it, and I okay. just didn't realize it. But um, anyway, uh, next up is this thing seems to be because so many artists have opened bars and started uh, liquor lines. Cole Swindell, Georgia boy, he's a South Georgia guy. He is a, a Georgia Southern guy, as a matter of fact. He used to sell T-shirts for Luke Bryan. Now became a star in his own right. A lot of number one hits, and he is launching his own brand of peppermint flavored moonshine. That not I don't vodka, know about. not rum, rum moonshine. But it's uh, through the Sugarlands Distilling Company, who uh, a, a guy I know named Joe Lasher. Hmm. He is also uh, a guy that endorses the Sugarlands Distilling Company. I have a oh, nice cool. little koozie at home with his name on the front and Sugarlands on the back, but. Yeah, so uh, look for that. Uh, you know, Kenny That's Chesney's awesome. got a rum, Florida Georgia Line. They yep. have they've got a liquor and I everybody's went to Zach Brown Band. Yeah, I went to their distillery up in Cleveland. Yeah, I think, right. Cleveland Which Mart. yeah, right. And uh, matter of fact, this past weekend had a, a bottle of Z Alexander wine. Cool. It was very good, very tasty. Uh, <laughs> Zach did well with that. And um, finally, what was the uh, the final story? Uh, Kane Brown is having a baby. <laughs> yeah, Kane Brown. He is from Fort Oglethorpe, Georgia, which is uh, not far, fra far from where I was born in Dalton, Georgia. My son, Jacob, who was actually born in Fort Oglethorpe, I think those two were born in the same hospital. Oh, how cool. It is cool. Um, That's awesome. He is, uh, he's having uh, a baby with his wife, Caitlin. Their first child. Yep. And her Instagram post said, the coolest day of my life, I can barely stop laughing and crying to get her, I guess they know it's a it's a girl. Girl, yeah. To let her um, get her pictures. I'm so happy and excited. Kane Brown, I love you so much, and I'm so excited to have addition to our family. There you go. So it's really cute. It is huge. If you like country music, we try to keep you up to, uh, uh, you know, just up to par, up to snuff, up to date. I hate using up to date because it sounds so cliche, but we'll say it here now because I can't think of anything else. And uh, oh, quickly, uh, yeah. Luke Bryan fans not liking to uh, knock boots. I was surprised I heard by that. I in the car. Yeah. And I thought, because I know you just talked about that. Yeah. I kind of like it. Have some little I love to knocking it. boots. Yeah. And I like the song, too. The Country Quickies here with uh, Caitlin Henderson. My name is Tug Cowart. We're in the Eric Church Headliner Studios, and it is uh, presented by Rooms to Go. Make sure you go check out the, uh, the Headliner Sofa. It's the ultimate sectional for the modern sports family. Appreciate you checking us out.